Hello YouTube. What we have here is a Craftsman 30cc weed whacker with speed start. Now these units have been lambasted on the internet with good reason because of bad engineering that is having to do with the speed start mechanism. Sorry for the bad camera work. This fan as you see, spins freely, whereas it should be attached to this crankshaft. The problem is the split star washer here becomes loose, and then when you go to try and pull start it, these pawls don't get engaged, or they do, and this fan spins around and the shaft does not. Sears says you have to replace the entire short block. But what they don't realize or don't tell people is that this shaft is a two-part shaft. So we're going to solve this problem today by removing the spark plug. And you can see here that I've taken a piece of cotton clothesline and stuffed it down into the spark plug hole. We did that so that the piston movement will be limited. Now, with the piston movement held in place by the uh, clothesline, get yourself a pair of vice grips or channel locks and start turning counterclockwise as my friend here is demonstrating. We've already pre-loosened this one. But as you'll see, the top part of this shaft unthreads. There you have it. Now you can remove the fan assembly and the crappy little star lock washer that Sears put on. What we're going to do is replace that with a new, better spring-loaded uh, lock washer, reassemble, and see what happens. Hopefully, problem cured for five cents. All right, so here we are. We're back, YouTube. And right here, we added our own new split lock washer that fit the shaft, assembled this clockwise, and tightened it down with a pair of pliers. And now, as you can see, when I rotate the fan, the whole shaft turns just as it should. It's a little bit loose, but I think if I need to, we'll add just another washer in there. We didn't really uh, completely cinch it, but I think we've got problem solved here for five cents. All right, good luck with your weed whacker, and uh, hopefully this works for you.